Non-Communicable Diseases, Deficiency Diseases by kscience.com. A deficiency disease is a disease caused by the deficiency of certain food groups or minerals or vitamins from your diet. A deficiency of protein, for example, if you don't eat enough eggs, milk, meat or lentils, these are all examples of foods with protein in them, then you could get a disease called kwashiorkor. Kwashiorkor. The famous symptom of someone with kwashiorkor is an enlarged belly. So it looks like they're healthy or overweight, but in fact it's because they're bloated. Someone with kwashiorkor, a protein deficiency, will also have small muscles and also be shorter than normal, due to a failure to grow properly. A deficiency in vitamin C, this will lead to a disease called scurvy. Scurvy can be caused by not eating enough lemons, limes or broccoli, for example. The main symptom of scurvy is bleeding gums. If it gets more serious, your teeth will fall out. So that is scurvy, caused by vitamin C deficiency. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. If you do not eat enough calcium or vitamin D, you could get a disease called rickets, otherwise known as osteomalacia, which are found in foods such as milk and vitamin D is found in oily fish. Without enough calcium, for example, your bones will be softer. If you really have not enough calcium in your diet and your bones become too soft, you will see people have curved legs. So curved legs caused by soft bones is a symptom of not eating enough calcium or oily fish and not getting enough vitamin D. Not eating enough iron can cause the deficiency disease called anemia and people can feel anemic. Food that are high in iron include red meat, spinach and eggs. Not eating enough iron and having anemia are going to cause your red blood cells to be smaller than normal. You will also have fewer red blood cells. This can lead to tiredness and lethargy. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Press pause to practice using those key words. The answers will follow. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. And if you're stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Visit kscience.com for more free videos, worksheets and quizzes at kscience.com and don't forget to like and subscribe.